AT&T is finally ditching two-year contracts, but we knew this was coming. For one thing, AT&T was the last of the major U.S. providers still offering the contracts. Also, the company got rid of some two-year contracts sold through third parties back in June. That and a higher up, the company told Recode earlier this year he thought the two-year contract and subsidized phone plan is one of those options that is going to go away slowly. Apparently not that slowly though. Starting January 8th, AT&T's customers will have to pay the full cost of the phone they choose, and they will not sign a contract. The only people the change won't affect are business customers with qualified wireless service agreements. You know who you are. For everyone else, you can pay for the phone at once or over time, because remember, people will have to pay the full price for their phones. A company spokesperson told USA Today that down payment options will be available with even lower monthly installments. If you're upset about the change, blame your fellow subscribers. People have complained for years about being locked into contracts, and without that agreement, certain perks like subsidized phones have to go away. For Newsy, I'm Leah Becerra.